Hi everyone. Well, before I show you what we're doing for art this week, I just want to revise, that means to go over something that we did last year around about this time. The fancy word is ordinal numbers, but we know it as first, second, third, fourth, fifth, and we did a lot of this last year for sports. We were doing sports days and things. So let's just go over, let's see if we can read first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, and tenth. So I'm just going to match up the number for these words. So first we use these when we do our date every morning at good morning. A quick way to write it is a one with a st. First. Second, a quick way to write it is a two with a n and a d. Second. Third, a quick way to write it is a three with a r and a d. Fourth is a four with a t and a h. Oops, did say? It says fourth. Fifth is a five. With a t and h, it says fifth. Turn over, we'll go sixth. It's just a six with a th. Seven is a seven with a th. Eighth is an eight with a th. Nine is a nine with a th. And ten is a ten with a th. Ten. Okay. Right, so I've got a little PowerPoint to show you. It's quite good fun. Let's see, from the beginning. Um, let me see, power slideshow from the beginning. Okay, it's Pirate Ordinal Numbers. And I've got my friend, Parrot and Pirate Pete. Percy Pirate and Pirate Pete to help us. Hello. And they're going to see a little bit about pirate ordinal numbers. Right, pirate, on you go. Press the button. Who is fifth? Fifth. So you look along. Well, first, second, third, fourth, fifth. Oh, it's this one with the eye patch and the brown beard at the end. Fifth. You are right. Well done. Oh, you want Parrot to go next? Okay. Right, Parrot, your turn. Who is second Parrot? Have a look. No, no, that's third. Have a look again. First. Second. This one with the red and white stripy t-shirt is second. Okay, don't worry, Parrot. We're all learning. Who is second? Third Pirate Pete, have a look. Who is third? Yes, it's the pirate with the parrot. What, what, what? Well done. Have a look. Circle the first pirate. Which one's the first pirate? Yes, put your circle round. Well done. It's the one, it's the lady pirate. Well done. Right, Pirate Pete, you're next. Circle the fourth pirate. One, two, three, four. Yes, it's the one with the parrot again. Good boy, well done. And that's the end. Oh, I like the pirate ship and the palm tree. I think that might be on a Caribbean island. Bye. So, we've had a wee look at first, second, third, fourth, fifth, all the ordinal numbers. So now for our art, we're going to make a sports day medal. Now, I've put this template in with the emails today. Um, so you could use that just to draw and design, have fun. But I've got another way to show you, if you don't want to do that. You could get some card or some paper. In fact, you could even use the bag. This is a chocolate bar. You could even use that to draw around. But all I've got is my cup. And I'm going to pop it down. I've got a pen and a pencil, and carefully I'm going to draw around. 
I'm going to get a lovely circle to see that. And then I'm going to take my scissors, remember, careful, careful. I'm going to cut round. And remember, friends, we said looking all the time, moving your fin fingers behind, little, little cuts all the way around, all the way around, moving your hand, always looking at the scissors, little tiny bits. That's how you'll keep it accurate, friends, if you just do little bits at a time. Et voila, there you are. Now, you could choose, I've got made up one already, and it says, can you tell me, is it first? Well done, first. And then I've got a medal that says, second, good. So I'll make this one a third. You can use any colour you want. Let me use your red this time. So third is a three, a er, and a diff. Third. So once you've written your number on, you can decorate it any way you want. With my medal, I just went round with a lovely, nice curvy pattern and then I coloured it in. You see that? But you can do anything you want. I mean, this time I might just use little, little dashes around, little pink dash around the edge, like this. A pink dash and let me do a green dot in the middle and I'll hold it up and show you very quickly but it's up to you friends i wouldn't put too much decoration in the middle part where the number is or it'll be hard to read so a little bit of decoration around the side and then well for this one i had a bit of ribbon that was tied around some flowers that somebody gave me so all i did was attach my tape at the back and i'm just going to pop that on first so if you don't have that, you could use string. This is an old lace that I found. So I'm going to use this lace for my third. So I'm going to pop it on the back. I've already topped it. I've already got my tape ready. And I'm going to stick it on here like this. And that's me ready. You might need an extra little bit. So I've always got some extra. And that's me. I've got my medal ready. So have fun with that. And if you can have a go, try and have your medals ready for tomorrow because we're going to be using them in our lesson all about the Caribbean. All right. So good luck with that, friends. Have fun. Bye.